actually just talk with them. My relationship is so close that I see you, I know you, I can just ask, hey, here's what I need. So Jesus acknowledges that some people in their spiritual journey feel this type of intimacy with him. They feel so close, they know he's so near that all they need to do is just to ask. Just to say, hey, you're here, and I'm trusting this, that if I ask, I will receive. So, Jesus, I'm going to ask for this. I'm going to ask for the things that you put on my heart, and I believe that I will receive if I continue to ask. So asking implies somebody feels very close to Jesus in their relationship with him. But it's so amazing that Jesus doesn't just stop there, because he knows that not all of us feel like we're so close to Jesus. And so he says, ask, and then he says, secondly, seek. What does seek imply? Seek implies that I I actually feel a little bit of distance. Seek implies that maybe I don't know where he is, or maybe I feel like we're we're so distant, and so I can't just ask Jesus for what's on my heart. I have to actually seek. I have to actually pursue him. I may feel like there's some distance, like there's some things between us, and Jesus says, I acknowledge that some people don't feel so close that all they can do is ask, And so he says, you know what? I'm still extending the invitation to you. For you, it's seek. And he says, if you seek, you you will find. So I don't don't give up on my relationship with Jesus if I I feel like I'm distant, if I feel like I'm not super close. Jesus says, you know what? Whatever stage, whether you're close, man, just ask, and you will receive. Whether you feel a little bit distant, you may need to put in a little extra work. It's going to be harder to seek than it is just to ask, but in order to ask, We have to seek. And it's amazing that it doesn't just stop there. Jesus actually says as well, he says, ask and it will be given. Seek and you will find. And then the third, he says, knock and the door will be open to you. What does knock imply? Knock implies even more distance. Knock implies that, man, I'm seeking, right? But it's like there's barriers between us. There's a door between us. I can't just ask. I can't say, hey, I just need this. There's something separating us. And Jesus says, In that case, if that's you, if you feel like there's barriers between you and him, which are most of the time things that we set up, they're barriers that we build, not God. God wants instant intimacy, but ourselves, we oftentimes put up barriers. Jesus says, you know what? That's okay too. If that's where you're at, if you don't feel so close where you can just ask, if you're seeking and you feel like there's barriers between us, a door between us, a closed door, Jesus says, that's okay. Because the invitation for you is to knock. He says, knock on that door. And as you knock, the the door's going to be open so that you can then enter and seek and you will find them there and then you can just ask and you'll receive. So it's so amazing that each one of these reveals really how close or distant we feel to Jesus. And in my experience of the Christian life, walking with Jesus, it isn't always just an asking process. We never are just consistent, just always feeling that nearness. There's times in my life where I'm like, man, I feel like, God, I don't know if you're actually there. So i got to seek you. Or I feel like, man, I'm seeking you, but I feel like there's some closed doors. I feel like there's some barriers between us. It could be because of sin in my life. It could be a lack of trust. It could be disobedience. It could be a whole lot of things. But even in my life, there's times where I'm like, man, there's doors between me and God. Not that he's setting up, but I love how the scripture acknowledges, how Jesus acknowledges everyone is at a different place in their journey, in their pursuit of Jesus. But no matter where you're at, Whether you feel super close, Jesus says, that's amazing, come and ask. Whether you feel distant, he says, that's okay, come and seek and you will find. Whether you feel like there's barriers, he says, that's okay, come and knock and the door will be open. 